got time for bitches Gotta keep my mind on my motherfucking riches Even when I die, they won't worry me Mama don't cry Yo, what's up? It's AV the Don Crypto here with another episode. Today I'm going to be talking about how to set up a MyEther wallet and how to send ERC20 tokens. The tokens that we're going to be using today is Lan Connect token. So right here guys, this is how you create the wallet. This is the interface of the front of the page. So we're going to be creating a new wallet. This is only for demonstration purpose only. So I'm going to call this a demo wallet. So right here, you're going to in input your password. It has to be nine characters long. So let's say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're gonna create that wallet. So it's gonna ask you to save your key store file. So this file right here is a it's a text file, and with this text file you can log into your wallet with your password. It's pretty much asking for an extra security um, to see if you are the owner of your wallet. Acts like an ID for your wallet. So you're gonna download that right there. And you're gonna hit I understand. So right here, I always emphasize this guys, always keep your private keys private, no matter what. Because if somebody was to have your private key, they could log anywhere in the world and just waltz right into your wallet and take control of your wallet and steal your funds. It's like giving somebody your house keys. So always keep this to yourself. Uh, what I usually do is, uh, I usually put on a notepad and I save it onto a USB drive. But for training purposes, we're going to be saving it onto my desktop. I'm going to name it P Demo. So I'm going to show an example on how to use the store file and your private key to log into your wallet. So after you save your address, you're gonna log into your wallet. So from here, I'm gonna use that key store file that I had downloaded from previously. You're gonna hit the select, and you're gonna look for this store file, which is under my downloads, all the way down right here. So you you want to keep that key uh, in a safe place too, because it acts like a login name on a profile. So pretty much that's a profile to your wallet and you're going to be typing in your password right here. So we, what I had was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And you're going to lock it without your, your key store file or JSON file. You wouldn't be able to log in to your wallet. So after you do that, I'm going to show you another example on why you should keep your private keys private. We're doing an example right here. Let's reset that. All right. So with the private key, I saved it on my desktop right here. And we're going to copy and paste that. And with the private key, you do not need a password. All you need is just the private key itself. And all you hit is unlock. And it takes you directly to your wallet. So now I'm going to teach you how to send ERC20 tokens to your MyEther wallet. So we're going to be using my my personal MyEther wallet. I already logged in. But we're going to use an ERC20 token from an exchange that I just bought. And I bought some Lend Connect tokens right here. 263 Lend Connect token. That's the best day to buy. Um, right now it is sitting around let me double check real quick guys oh the price is going up and that price is let's see how many I'm copy and paste that real quick sitting around 75 cents Wow so I bought my link and neck token at at a dip when it's sitting around 2840 Satoshi and it's rising right now guys so Definitely, you guys should jump into this Link Connect tokens. There's only three and a half million tokens circulated total. And the reason why I want to emphasize on that is because they're doing all the right moves right now. They're redeeming themselves slowly. If you look at that uh, Telegram, they are rebranding themselves in a good way. And what I see is market. They're marketing more. 
new logo, new year, and I gotta go back to this right here. Lending platform. So the, right now the price of the token is around 50 cents. You're getting a bargain. Consider it as a Black Clarence Friday. Okay guys? Daily interest rates between 1.5% and 5%. And each Link Connect token is targeted at $5 per one token. So they're not worried about the price of the token. They know that once their platform comes out that a lot of people is going to see the potential it has to grow as the community start growing. I'm not your financial advisor. Definitely do your own research. But I'm telling you guys right now, I just picked up more tokens. But let's get back to... Uh, Let's get back to sending this ERC20 token to my, my Ether wallet. I'm going to go to my uh, withdraw. Actually, my account. Sorry about that. Coin exchange is kind of slow today, but it still works. That's all that matters. All right, now we're here on my wallet right now. I'm going to go to withdraw. I'm going to withdraw all the tokens. And into my, my personal wallet ethereum address so we're gonna copy this address right here and bring it over here paste it of course gotta put my password in you know submit withdraw currency is halted or in maintenance mode please try again dang so for training purposes so once you send an ERC20 token to your ether wallet and the way you would check it is by checking the transaction history right there you click on the etherscan.io then you go over to token transfer this is where the ERC20 token that you sent into your wallet would be populated and since I have Link Connect tokens already in my wallet it populated here this thing acts like a tracking number on a Amazon package so for training purposes since I was not able to send any link connect tokens from the coin exchange market I will demonstrate on how to send my link connect tokens to the link connect wallet to start lending when the day comes so from here you need an address to send it to so right here there's a wallet you click on wallet on the dashboard and you copy this address right here it says minimum deposit limit one Note: please only transfer link connect tokens and ether to this wallet sending any other token may result into a loss and no wallet credit a small transaction fee will be debited to realize link connect token so right now this is how you would send something out and you put the amount that you want to send out but yeah and you hit the generate transaction and after that it generates the transactions right here and you hit the send transaction and this pop-up is gonna pop up right here it's gonna ask you if you want to send whatever amount of tokens you want to send to this wallet you either want to make a decision send it or no but we're not gonna send anything right now just because we're gonna wait for that lending platform to come out and when the time comes best believe that I'm gonna be lending out majority of my tokens at five dollars alright guys that's about it signing out this is AV the Don Crypto peace when I look around I always learn something and that is to be always yourself and to express yourself to have faith in yourself do not go out and look for a successful personality and duplicate it